few years ago, uh, we did face unique challenges as KBR. It was, for example, in our asset tracking, our fridges. It was, uh, for example, free issue management. As you know, we've had a very big problem with fridges. Uh, we've been losing our fridges uh, within, within the trade itself. We do not know where they are. Whenever they move, can we, we, can't even, we can't even find them. So we then did reach out to uh, Safaricom, uh, who are our technology partners and have been for a very long time. And we then decided to come up with an innovation workshop. And uh, it took us a, a bit of time. Uh, representatives from, uh, uh, from KBL and from Safaricom coming together, brainstorming and coming up with a solution. And the cul culmination of all that is the solution that we have today. Uh, which is which is an asset tracking solution. This solution uh, works in a simple way where it uses uh, Internet of Things or IoT technology. Basically, it helps the business to track its assets uh, in terms of location, in terms of how it is being used, and uh, how it's being applied in terms of uh, maintaining the quality of the product. We wanted our consumers to experience our brands as a session with them at six degrees. We could not tell that from the office uh, how we can execute. A lot of these as sensors that are put in place, you can see the performance of the compressor, you can get the temperature of the cooler, you can see which cooler is being powered on and off, you can see which outlet is not using the cooler right way because when the cooler stays for a week without being powered on, there's a problem. Then also you can also see the guys who are moving our coolers without our authorization. Hence the element of loss goes down to almost 0%. The solution is, is meant to enhance our thinking. Our deduction of insights from the solution will help us make the right decisions, especially in categories that we play at beer level. For example, if an outlet is part of the trade leading, we need to focus on some insights that deliver numbers as per our expectation and also meet the customer needs, which is profit making. This is now engineered into analytics, business intelligence, whereby you dig in for more insights we will start asking ourselves, are the assets being utilized the right way? Are we getting value from these assets? Are some assets being idle? And then gives you the solution or now you can rationalize them. This uh, solution fits into the bigger EBU agenda of digitizing Kenya by the simple fact that we're able to use uh, emerging technologies like IoT to be able to gather data, uh, to analyze it and uh, use it uh, for making uh, you know, insight-led uh, business decisions. Uh, it's also helping uh, businesses to be able to digitize uh, so that they can be, remain competitive, to also have uh, innovative solutions that speak to the challenges our customers have in the market today. There's an opportunity as an organization, you know, to partner with other players in the industry to be able to co-create and deliver value for the customers and the wider citizens of this country. I can tell how much we sold every day. Now I can even further tell whether our fridges are being well taken care of because this has been a challenge for us. We're investing every year with a lot of uh, fridges. So I'm expecting some cost cutting to come from this process because we know where they are and we get the bad guys, we take them to their homes and other places to stop. They'll also be in the right outlets. We can tell whether they're cold and I think that's for me that's the most exciting because we know cold for us drives sales and at the end of the day what we want to do is to drive business growth and sales. EABL today is able to know exactly where their coolers are, the temperature of the coolers and how many times that cooler door is open. Is the cooler on or off? Consumers can be assured of the same standard of service wherever they are because the thing about technology is that technology assures parity. So wherever you are it is the same drink consumed at the same temperature in the same way. Consumers, number one, will get better service and number two, they'll be assured of the quality of what it is. The future is unlimited. We would like to deduce more insights from this project and I believe technology is the future. As ambition of KBL is to become the best performing, most trusted and most respected consumer products company uh, in, in Africa. And if you look at ways to achieve that, one of the key enablers is technology.